It's your boy here, come back at you again with another video. And of course, this is another uh, Peeper 101 Tower Rangers. Uh, I'm going to pretend the last one didn't happen. As I didn't write down my information, and uh, yeah, I felt pretty ashamed. So, you know, without further ado, let's get into, get into Peeper 101 Power Rangers. So I guess this is part two, I guess. Whatever. Red Ranger Power. Yeah. So I'm going to tell y'all guys, everything that I've found about Power Rangers, some stuff that I didn't even know. Alright, let's get into this. Okay. What is a standard episode of the Power Rangers? Well, essentially, you've got your teenagers and they're going through their day-to-day -day lives. However, Zordon and Alpha usually call them up. And who are Zordon and Alpha? Zordon is a giant ball, is a bald head man, bald head man inside of a giant suit. And he looks blue. And Alpha, as also which is called Alpha 5, is in a is like kind of like a robot. It's like C-3PO without the Britishness. That's the best way I can describe Alpha. Except for he actually is kind of helpful and funny sometimes. So Zordon and Rita have been in war for several years until you know she got put in a trash can and after 10,000 years, it was time for her to conquer Earth. So Zordon and Alpha recruited five teenagers for Alpha, five teenagers with attitude, and they, with the Power Ranger morphing coins that they found. And so they gave them the powers, and they gave them the Megazords, and they, which are dinosaur themed, and they gave them the powers and the, the morphing grid which helps them morph from humans to Power Rangers. Yeah, that's what's called the Morphing Grid. Now, there are different types of Rangers, each of them representing a color in a dinosaur. Red is Tyrannosaurus Rex, blue is Triceratops, green was a Godzilla-esque dinosaur. Let's see. Pink Ranger was the Pterodactyl. Uh, yellow was the saber tooth tiger. Black was the mammoth. Yeah, black was the mammoth. White, I don't, I don't remember what white was. And so the dinosaurs, the the megazords, they get put together, and they make one giant robot called the Ultra Megazord. And so that that's what they use to fight the giant monsters because. Rita makes small monsters and launches them into onto Earth. So the Power Rangers have to fight them along with putties, which are Rita's guards. Then of course you got Godar and and then all of her other henchmen. And so they fight the Power Rangers. And so usually Rita when once defeated the monster of that episode is defeated the first time, because there's a new monster every episode. He turns like three stories tall and using Super Sentai footage we uh, we see that both the Power Rangers Megazord giant robot thingy with the sword and the monster fights and usually the Megazord wins that's the basic gist right there and on the way we also got different people called Bulk and Skull. Bulk and Skull are essentially first they're bullies to the Power Rangers, then they're trying to figure out who the hell the Power Rangers are, then they want to be cops, then they start a detective agency, and then they just they sort of become kind of like mentor things. So they have a lot of very interesting character development during three seasons of the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. I know someone very well, Spike, you know, I dedicate these videos to him. 
And uh, he's probably gonna be like, huh, oh, that that happened? I don't know. Whatever. So the so Zordon and Alpha found the power of morphing coins. So what are the coins and the Megazords made from? A ninja superhero called Ninjor, which is a blue weird ninja guy. It's really weird. He sounds like uh, Nostalgia Critic's brother. If you've ever seen, if you ever seen Nostalgia Critic. Uh, so, throughout the show, Rita keeps on failing, but then an eviler person, a much more cooler person, the evil lord Zed, takes over, and he does some really cool stuff like, you know, destroy the Green Ranger, which was actually a bad guy in the beginning, yeah, it was a five-part series. Yeah, Jason David Franco was the evil Power Ranger, he's Tommy in the show. And then blue is Billy, and I believe black is Zach. Okay. Uh, yellow is Kimberly. Pink is Kimberly. Uh, pink is Kimberly. I want to say yellow is Stephanie. Yeah, whatever. Let's see what else we got here. Okay. And so, they almost defeat the Power Rangers numerous times, unlike Rita. Although, later on, when he gets the health potion and starts, or, or love potion, Rita puts inside of something. They have a wedding. Uh, Zed becomes all soft. Whatever, he's still just cool. I can't wait for them to make the Funko Pops of him. Yeah, they got Power Rangers Funko Pops. Yeah, it came to be surprised last year, too. So, the new armor, they had new armor to fight uh, Rita's dad, Master Vital, who makes he pukes monsters, egg monsters out, and it's all kinds of fucking dumb. So, uh, yeah, that shit happened. It was all kinds of, it's all kinds of weird. So, you got them together, and they almost killed the, the Power Rangers, and lots of really weird shit. So they have to make new armor that was glitter. So they went from Rita to Zed to Master Vile. And so I guess they need a new armor. They, they eventually do pick up new Megazords, and I forgot what they are. And uh, yeah, we got those. And then Ninjor, once the power morphing coins get stolen, he gets them ninja powers, and it's all kinds of fucking dumb. It, it just gets stupid, guys. A kid show just gets stupid. I, I, I know how ridiculous that sounds. And so we got the... So we got them wearing glitter. That's, that's, the, that's the bigger, better armor, is the Power Ranger suits covered in glitter. And then, so once that shit gets destroyed, they become Mighty Morphin Alien Rangers because there's a backwards thing in time and they're kids. And so aliens have to help them out called Equations. And it's all kinds of fucking dumb. It just gets dumb, guys. It just gets dumb. Mighty Morphin Alien Rangers was a spin-off and, you know, had a lot of that Super Sentai footage. So, what else? So, yeah, the, the equations are a piece of crap. They're like, they got like giant purple sacks on top of their head, and you could tell that the makeup wasn't that done nice, and ugh. Ugh. And, of course, I could talk about the movie. So, basically, on accident, Rita and Zed unleash ooze, Ivan ooze, which is all kinds of weird. And the, the movie itself isn't too bad. It's just, you know, it could have been a lot cooler.
and then we of course got something from back in time and then Miss Master Vile wants to get that. It's called the Zeo Crystal. What is the Zeo Crystal? Well it's like a crystal that powers up people and only good people can touch it and you know it, it gives people powers and it and it you become, you become more powerful over time. It's all kinds of fucking weird. Excuse me. <coughs> Sorry, I'm wearing a mortal skin. I usually don't do that unless I'm making videos. That makes me kind of vulnerable. Uh, so yeah, that's all. In case you want to know what I drew here, it's just random ranger with the thunderbolt there. So yeah, that, that definitely wraps it up. And uh, on the next episode, we're going from Zeo to Hero. Ha 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 ha! This will be next Wednesday. Hopefully they've worked up the, the government facility. Fucking air. Whatever, it's fine. So yeah, so once the school simulation starts, you'll be getting, on the first Saturday of the month, you'll be getting a potluck video. I don't know, I'm going to maybe make a wheel or something. I'm like, what kind of video I want to make that day. On But on Wednesdays, for sure, you'll be getting a Power Rangers video. And on Friday, you'll be getting movie news. Now, anything else that comes out during there, during those times, during the school thingy, is not planned. I repeat, it is not planned. It's just I wanted to make a video. Okay? Just want to tell y'all guys that straight up. I'm not going to be uploading as much because I want to have the freedom that I do now. Excuse me. Has breakfast this morning. But I hope y'all guys have, a, have had a great an interesting education of the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. And next up is that we'll be going into Power Rangers Zero. And, um, yeah, it's going to be pretty cool. I don't think y'all guys are going to like that one. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to work on some other future projects. May the power protect you. Peep her out.